this is my second field experience reflection. So for this field experience, I went to North High School and I was in an English classroom. And the class first started off with 15 minutes of um, time devoted to free writing. And so the teacher put up an image on the whiteboard or the, um, the screen and the students were able to use their creativity and imagination to make up a story or write about the image that they saw. And then um, after they had 15 minutes of free writing for this, they were able to discuss what they wrote. Some of them shared out loud and some of them um, did not. And then finally after that, the students were engaged by getting to watch the video that the picture was from. The image was from a music video and so the students were able to watch the music video afterwards and it was actually like a Halloween themed one because it was close to that time. And then finally the last part of the class was dedicated to talking about a novel that they're in and so they discussed like things like plot, characters, setting, and were able to talk about that. So how did I help? For this field experience, I was mostly there as an observer because a lot of the time was dedicated to the novel, which I had not read. And so, um, yeah, I was mostly there just to observe and get to see the different teaching styles that were happening. I added a little bit to the conversation here and there um, at the beginning because it was talking about a free write. And so that was something that you did not have to be present in other classes or yeah, in other classes in the past four. So I got to add some to the conversation for the free write. But other than that, I was mostly an observer. Um, and then finally, also something I did was just talk with the teachers about education tips and um, different things that they would like to pass off to a future educator. And so that was really interesting to learn from them. Right, also there were two teachers, and so there was one um, teacher who, who was the English teacher, and then there was another teacher present in the classroom as um, a helper for special ed. And so I thought that was very cool to see as well. So how was technology used to enhance learning? So first for the free write prompt, technology was used obviously to show the image that inspired students writing, and then also to engage the students and give them a brain break um, so they could watch the video that the image was from. So what were my strengths and weaknesses? I would say that it was kind of hard to evaluate my strengths and weaknesses during this field experience because I was mostly there as an observer. So I was not able to um, participate or help as much as I would have liked, I think. Um, yeah. So how will I improve next time? I think I will improve next time by being less of just an observer, hopefully, and more of a helper around the classroom. And I can do that by asking the teacher how I can um, be more, be of more assistance. And hopefully that will um, make me less of an observer and more able to help students with whatever they need. How will this contribute to my professional identity as a teacher? I think this will contribute to my professional identity as a teacher by helping me to see the benefit of free rights and learning how to incorporate technology into that. I think that is something that has been um, appearing in many of my classes this year, free write, the benefits of free writing and um, to see that firsthand in a classroom was very cool and I loved how it um, just is able to play off of students' creativity and allow them to um, right without restrictions and then be able to share that with others I think is very cool and so that and also it has made me understand areas where I can grow such as being more assertive and vocal and how I can be of assistance for future opportunities in the classroom if I go to shadow another teacher I think I would be more vocal about um, helping out so yeah that's my reflection